Hey guys, welcome to the next episode, episode 8 of Let's Play the Feed the Beast uh, adventure map, I'm going to call it. Yep, finally figured out what I'm going to call it, an adventure map, because that's what we're having. A great old adventure. Oh, it's in the, oh yeah, the sturdy cage. Uh, forgot to make the sturdy cage, that's okay. Sturdy machine, not sturdy cage. Sturdy machine. That there. That there. And we got ourselves an apiary. apiary. If we got ourselves an apiary, you know what that means. Bees. Yep. I don't know what, how they're going to come in handy, but I know they will. So we're going to put one right here. So no queen. So if I go over here. See if we get ourselves. What, what would be good for us to get? Forest, meadow. I think I'm in a meadow right now. So we get ourselves a metal drone. A metal princess. That should give us a queen. But don't quote me on that. Put the drone here. Put the meadow princess up here. That should turn her into a Rain. Okay, so she doesn't like the rain. I think one block would just do it. Alright, nope. I do it? Nope. Um, hmm. Because it is nighttime, if I sleep in my bed, it should theoretically stop raining. So let's see if this works or not. Da, 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 da. All right, let's see what the queen wants to do. Unknown Gino. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I saw some particles go out. Ooh, that looks cool. Uh, I think we can destroy this glass. Actually, you know what? I'm going to make this corner a B corner. So we're going to build it up. Three more high? Yeah. Yeah, that doesn't change anything. Ooh, we got a honeycomb. Cool. No, Queen's not going to go very long, but as soon as we get enough of that honeycomb stuff, then that'd be pretty cool. Uh, let's see. Just bring it right on over. Bring it like right down to here. Made it! Yay! Okay, so now that we get... Oh! That's okay. We got another honeycomb? Nope, so no honeycomb. But let's see here. I don't need that block. But I do. Would you like the, the top of the pyramid now glows? Let's see if I want to make this a square. How many blocks is this? Oop. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So from this one, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. On the bottom of that block. There. And I am obviously going to need a whole lot more glass, so I'll be right back. Actually, I'm going to cut the video here or cut the scene here until we're done with all this glass. So we'll just stand on top of here like so. So this here will be all engaged. And I might have a few more apiaries. I may have the apiary chest or whatever it's called all set. And we can start learning about bees because I'm, I'm actually quite curious now about bees. It'd be quite interesting to see how they work and everything else. 
So I'll be right back, guys. Alright, and she's done. And I got a few bits of honey. And apparently the queen also leaves a princess and two drones behind. So maybe that's a random number or I don't know. But we'll find out soon enough. So I need to first off get rid of some of this glass except for one. And I'll show you why. Because we are going to be making the apiary chest. Got the apiary's bag, which is a chest with that, but I rather have the chest. Because chests are stationary and they're guaranteed not to be destroyed unless there's a creeper nearby. Which is highly un which is highly unlikely because there's no way in a creeper is ever gonna get in here. Come on, get in here. No, I should there we go. Perfect. We're gonna actually do this out here because there's no real reason to put it in there. Alright, so this thing stores bees. So one queen, one princess, two drones. Unknown genome. So how do I find out genomes? That's what I want to know right now. That's where, I'm, where my curiosity comes into play. So we do this again. We get ourselves another meadow. It's not daytime. I can change that. Just like this. Ta da Alright, pass. Okay. So apparently mobs spawn in 1.2.5 because this is quite ridiculous that we got cows in here. But eh, they don't care. They still do their business. Maybe by putting down more flowers, they create more honey. So I'm testing that out right now. That's why there's a whole bunch of flowers everywhere. Yeah. Okay, so, as we wait for this guy to die down or whatever they do, uh, I'm going to pause it right here and go look on the wiki on how to figure out what genome is what, because I'm completely clueless and have no idea whatsoever how this or all of this here works. If I took out the queen, two queens. You know what? I'm going to come over here and actually pick up all my bees out of here. And store them over there. That seems to be the right thing to do right now. And this isn't going to sort out for me, so I'm going to take all these out and just do them like this. One per page. I'm, no, can't do that. Metal, 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 strong. Modest, modest, mod, modest. Tropical. Another modest. Nope, nothing. Alright guys, I'm going to pause the video here, figure out what genomes and all that other stuff is, and I'll be right back once I figure out all that stuff. It's, oh, we're almost hitting 24 hours on this Feed the Beast thing. Not doing too bad. We only got a few more to unlock and then we're all done, as far as I know. Alright, so I'm going to pause it here, like I said before, blah, 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 blah. Hey guys, uh, I see we're nearing uh, the, near the 24 hour mark of playing the Feed the Beast adventure map. So far, it's pretty good. I'm just compacting bees basically right now with a bealizer I got here. Put this down, put this here. And yeah, so just gonna wait for that timer to go around and then I'm gonna keep on doing these bees and 
not a whole lot going on. You just put them here, they go together, and you're done. So here we go. Countdown in T minus 27, 20 seconds from now. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Here we go, screenshot. Ha Oh. And I got quite a few more bees to go yet. So like I said, I'm going to pause this video till I go through all my bees and oh, skeleton. Hey, guess what? Wall. Alright, so I'll see you guys later. And guys, I think it's about wrapping up point, so um, just as a new thing, let's see uh, how much, uh, oh, there we go, we have matter we've collected up in this episode. Eh, not too much, not too bad. There's about a little bit more than 50 there. See, even the MK can't keep up with that machine down there. It's like blazing. Blaze Rod EMC Gen. Plus, my model right here is, um, what's it called, um, module, module, just take out this middle chest here and you'll be all good. So yeah, uh, let us just quickly see how much EMC this is. And for the big one, boom, 43 million EMC. Yeah, I thought so my client store there wasn't going to be able to get all that. But that's okay. No problem. We got ourselves another client star. This one here is nearing full. See, that one didn't even make one. Is that one? Is my EMC generally made two? This one here made one, but I think it was already about to make one anyways. Uh, this one has low tier. Now, in theory, it is quite fast. Because it is created a Mark III, but so is this thing. And this thing right here, about that across it from here onwards, is like what? A 3 by 3. This is optional right here. That's it. 3 by 3 by... Huh, look at that. 3 by 3 by 3 minus power cables. If I include power cables, the shortest I can make it is a uh, three by four by two high. No, three high because uh, I can put the cables to go underground. So yeah, it's pretty cool. And my MFE, not losing a single bit of power. So yeah, look at this, look at this, look at this. How awesome is this? Orbs award. Oh no, that's a light. So what else do we got left on this thing? Uh, we got biofuel cans, bedrock, and the electricity. That's it. And let's see. There's one, one, two, three, four, one. Two, three. Where's number four? See, that's not on. Oh, that's not on. That's not on. Maybe this one lights on when you unlock them all. Let's, we'll assume that. Yeah, but this thing's gonna be pretty epic. We looks cool. All right, so guys, thank you for watching this episode, and I hate that radio. Uh, thank you for watching this episode. Stay tuned for episode nine, I believe nine. Don't hold me accountable for that. But uh, episode nine, if so, is gonna be totally awesome because we'll be doing a lot of bee stuff. But right now, it's a bit late here, and I need some sleep because I gotta do lots of work in the morning around this gym. So, until next time, time guys, uh, have a good night's sleep, at least for me, and...